Ja se on murjesta. Sitten olisi taas tota, näin, Sherlockin pariin mentäisiä. Varmaan mennään nyt tonne talon sit sisälle ensin. Sitten tää juoksi tuolta. something important behind it. I can feel it. Se on niinku toi. Ah. I remember returning home with a pair of perfect sticks. We wanted to turn them into training swords. Oh, that's right. We stood there, frozen, staring at something huge in the main hall. Aquarium with a living mermaid in it. Impossible. It must have been something else. <laughs> oh, of course. That mortifying hoax presently taking up space in our front yard. Well, fine. Your memory's better than mine. But I'm sure we started examining it immediately. And someone else was around, too. It was my mother. She asked what I thought of the artifact. You were really concentrating and holding something in your hand. I inspected it with a magnifying glass and was able to confirm it was made of two different skeletons. The mermaid was a fake. And so it was time to smash the thing. Your mother took a hammer and... <laughs> Slow down, John. That's not how it happened. I remember other people joined us. The workers took the artifact and placed it into the cabinet of curiosities. It became part of Mother's collection of fakes. She always said that the truth lies in the details. This mermaid helped me to learn that. Okay, nyt taukastoi ovi. Ah yes, my mother's studio. She was an authenticator, and this was her cabinet of curiosities. Mother I never saw the point. The what does it matter Scottish if some Viking. artifact is real or not? So he tried to persuade everyone that his forest was inhabited by these beasts. It would have been thrilling if it were actually true. One of the most ridiculous fakes I ever saw. Its owner insisted it was a polar bear. He thought the white paint on the brown fur wasn't noticeable. Ei oteta tota nyt vielä, kun tutkitaan tää nyt ensin. Watkinson and Holman, Chapter One, by Wallace Deorum. Oh, Mycroft. He always acts so serious, but then reads tripe like this. John, if I remember correctly, you couldn't put this book down. Another fake Holy Grail. Its owner claimed to be the heir of King Arthur. Scarcely believable. He also insisted a deadly rabbit was hunting him. The full plate armor of Sir Robert Swanford. I was told my father won it in a wager. Armor is armor, but look at his sword. Oh, how badly I wanted to wield the blade.
Clearly, it was deliberately torn. I wonder why someone would do that. The Tulpa. Studies in Tibetan mentalism. An impressive number of bookmarks. Someone was rather obsessed with this subject. And this one was brought from a German museum. They claimed it belonged to the so-called mummy of a Persian princess. The defrauders did good work, but missed an archaeological find <coughs> should be here. It's far better than beneath the old city walls. Look, it's Roger. This jolly old man's well preserved. He even looks refreshed. I doubt he drew much interest at the auction. That's for the best. I'd be upset 1852, hands. Bingley, West Yorkshire. This photo caused a lot of fuss. My mother spent some time to prove it was a fake. <laughs> Carefully opened. Dated 24th of April, 1869. So many calling cards. Mycroft like to keep useful people at hand. Officer Luciano J. Placido. Reliable and driven. I recognize Mycroft's handwriting. This drawer was always closed. Only Mycroft knew how to open it. I remember we tried to break it open and spy on him, but alas, had no success. Maybe today's the day. Oh, Sherry. I'm starting to remember something. Oh, I remember these. We used them to spar together until Mycroft found out and forbade us from using real weapons. I remember this cozy blanket. It was perfect for Wigwam! Oh, that was a joy to build them. Imagining ourselves as wayfarers on the other side of the world. I used this ladder to look at the top shelf, right? On the day of Mother's breakdown upstairs. Right you are, Sherry. We heard a noise. I can't recall of exactly what. And we didn't have a great view from behind the statue. Books and papers from the table somehow ended up on the floor. Now it's coming to the surface. I feel it. Hassit lähdetään taas mielen sopupoihin. Okay, then it 
todennäköisempi. Mä olin tuolla salaa kuuntelemassa. Koitetaan tämmöstä. Muita vielä. You're not even trying, Sherry. Okei, okay, se oli väärin. Koitetaan tähän sitten tää. Come on, Sherry. Let's go outside. Wait. Did you hear that? Come here, Sherry. You call this progress? Charlatan, amateur. I'm not letting you anywhere near my mother again. So there was a quarrel between them. I heard a noise in the hall. Let's check it out. Hey, come on, Halusin. Then Viela. Ah, the memory comes back. We snuck about watching him. He closed the drawer and went to the hall. We were like two shadows crawling behind him. Archaeological find should be here. It's far better than beneath the old city walls. Ah, niin nyt tässä piti. Sherry, look. We've got a parcel here. Hurry up and let's see what's inside. He opened the door to the postman and they exchanged documents. If it was a real postman, of course. on the wall was slightly a tilt. He stopped and straightened it. Then he threw some logs into the fire and sat in his armchair to read. It's as boring now as it was then. I'm sorry, Sherry, but I think that's it. Wait, John, we never use the fireplace in the mornings. What if... A bit of juniper in the fireplace created a soothing atmosphere. It's the little things, isn't it? I think this is what we're looking for. No, niin, nyt löydettiin avainsara. Ja tässä oli niitä Johnin haasteita, mä luulen, että he tavallaan siihen päähommaan. We made it. So what's there? Single malt whiskey. My cross favorite. Otto Richter. Gifted by Queen Victoria herself. This one is rather thick. <coughs> Mycroft can be truly dogged in his research. Dossiers on the most influential people on Cordona. Mycroft always had a habit of building files on everyone he met.
an invitation that comes with a mask. We can't miss this, Sherry. Taas on Vogelilta. Ranssaraissa, okei. Okay. Kordona ape. Tossa on toi, mutta siis noin sitten on noin, niinku hetkonen kordon ape. Tuolta kautta. Tää kirkko jo, mä oon pahoittelut, törmäsin. Mm. Jaa, se onkin tämä. Se toisi. Pääsinkö mä tämmöisen saavu asuussa? I'm so sorry, but this is a costume Joo. party. Aa, siis täytyykö mulla olla joku... Asu. Pääsenkö mä... Eh. Miksi se nyt vaihda sitä? Ainakin tiedä miksi mä olin nyt pukeutunut, mutta... I'm so sorry, but this is a costume party. Okei, okay, sit täytyy jostain käydä ostamassa, missä täällä on lähin... Lähin vaatepuoti. Tossa. Mm. 
simply the best, the finest clothes for the finest citizens. Meta. A perfect choice. Se on niinku naamiaiset, niin luulis nyt, et sinne kelpaa melkein mikä vaan. Mistäs mä pääsin nyt takas? <köhön> Miksi mä pysty ole se joku jäätelömyyjä? Mikä siinä oli tota... I'm so sorry, but this is a... Stream party. Outfitit ei toimi. Kun inat sonin. Täytyy tää olla tää Prince of. Toi sitten. Welcome, sir. Just. I do hope you enjoy yourself. Ihan turhaan tuhlasi rahat. Enjoy the evening, sir. There is still plenty of time before the grand finale. All right. What if I write an article about these people here?
Can you help me gather information about Cordona's elite? Vogel's <laughs> gallery has a backer, I see. My goodness, Sherlock. They made a fountain. No, John, it's definitely not blood, me just wine. Go horse it, I guess. Sherlock, friend, I wasn't sure you'd come. Werner, I uh, see you are not yourself. The more time you spend here in Cordona, the more I feel it my duty to bring you into our world and show you all we have to offer. And what is on offer today? Pleasure, indulgence, relief, and relaxation. You've earned some time for yourself, have you not? Those who know me would say I'm incapable of it. <laughs> Nonsense. I refuse to believe there is anyone permitted to know Sherlock Holmes. Huh. You may be right. Then free yourself from inhibition and expectation. The night is young, and so are the guests. You should try to enjoy both. It's not healthy for handsome men to spend every night alone. And certainly not in a house filled with such melancholic memories. I must admit, my travels have proven more taxing than expected. I'm less confident in my life and myself. Time of relaxation seems a distant dream. So can I tempt you with a physical aid to your moral consolations? There's wine, of course. Yes, something more spiritual. A potentiator to sharpen the mind. A 7% solution of... My mind is my most <coughs> valuable asset and a finely tuned instrument. I will not risk impeding its function. My ultimate duty is to provide the world with truth, and I do that perfectly well as is. Duty? You've never cared about that before. Of course I do. Exposing a lie, revealing a fact, that is a moral resp- <laughs> That's not morality. Morals are what happens afterwards when truth collides with consequence. Do you ever follow up on cases you solved? Do you ever see what happened next, visit the victims, ensure justice is served in the courts? And how do you choose where to direct your attention? Are there not deserving causes to which your brilliance could be applied but isn't? You ascribe me more power than I possess. I have a narrow skill set and work within that mandate. What occurs afterward is irrelevant. With every action or inaction, you place a finger on the scales of morality. Many in the city would see you as abdicating your responsibility. I, I haven't. Not me, of course. Morality is subjective, just like truth. There is little to be gained from indulging in it, and far better thing. Now I must insist on easing any burdens I've placed upon your shoulders. Show yourself a kindness, and try this rather delectable concoction. If this solution truly does assist with thinking, then perhaps it would be... Yes, Sherlock. And now, ah. Our... <laughs> I just remembered. I'm sorry, Sherlock. My mind's delightfully impaired. Please take this key. It opens the altar room, past the library. Pardon? Altar room? Go quickly and find our Fabio. Only you can make him talk. I'll join... Jaha, totta kai sä Johnny oot siellä heti. Nancio's had to enforce the masks after the scan.
Tää on ihan tyhmä, kun... Näet pystyy vaan niinko... That's what I like about this party. Bring me more dirt, Sherry. One more piece, and I can expose these base hedonists. Okay, me täytyy joku tommonen kuunteluhomma löytää jostain muualta. Do you know what was here before Manchiosa's family bought it? I'll pin them down with this scoop. Thank you, Sherlock. No niin, saatiin se suoritettu. Ei tarvi siitä nyt rehtiä sitä. And you still need a crack. May I ask you something? No, I've heard nothing. But I can help you with something else. I like wearing this mask. I feel mysterious. No, what did I have to do? Oh, that's a cool one. Kirjaston takan. Oli se tää? Was he here this whole time? The herbs here are salvia divinorum. They have a slight hallucinogenic effect to emphasize the ceremony. <coughs> this elaborate box must be for the ritual dagger. The ointment smells mouse-like. I presume it is an aphrodisiac prepared from a Spanish fly. The ointment smells... This oil has a slight aroma of flowers and olive. This one looks like a twisted symbol of Venus drawn in a hurry. The sign reminds me of the astrological symbol for Mars. Handcrafted and luxurious cufflinks. There's also a note. For my Fabio, Manchos. The key is similar to the one that Vogel gave me. The capital F on the key fob might refer to Fabio. Would you recognize me in one of these? I suppose not. This is a different ritual. How can anyone accept such behavior? A useful tool for a disguise arsenal. The pitcher is empty, but with puddles around it. Blood clots are adhered to the sides of the drain. Yeah, kuvia tänne mahtaa niinku olla. Props, decorations, and tools for a more detailed set. Identical to the robes the guests are wearing.
Enough cigars to burn down the entire mansion. Why don't people tidy up after themselves? Blood. A sturdy bottle met a not so sturdy human. It didn't break only because it was unopened. An open wound spoiled the carpet. Pitäisikö he mun mennä takas sinne itse ruumis? Tää nyt tuntuu jatkuvan täällä niinku... Vai meneekö se tästä nimenomaan takas sinne? This crude tattoo partially covers a slave branding. The dagger is heavy and sharp, but lacks balance. This golden handle has a blood stain on it. This worm-like sigil has been drawn with his own blood. A blunt force trauma may have sucked an internal hemorrhage. The victim has clenched the fabric so firmly in his fist that it's nigh impossible to remove it. The wound is deep. A precise strike reached the heart. He died right here. Werner, care to explain uh. what is going on here? On nights like these, it's not unusual for some attendees to get a little exuberant. It Unfortunately, it appears things have gotten out of hand. Yes, some are more prone to bend the rules of morale. That's murder. I doubt there's anything left to bend. Why did you not tell me immediately? We were chatting about trivial matters for some time. If I'm completely honest, Sherlock, I've consumed a rather potent cocktail of substances. My attention slips and... Tr but I'm glad I thought to call f You sent me a disguise. Oh dear. Did I? Well, since I found the body, Mr. Manchios has agreed that you can investigate the matter. I promise my mind will behave itself. All right. Then pull yourself... Mr. Manchios is the owner of... And the host of Cordona's most memorable parties. He promises even the... And for the ones with more unconventional tastes, must... What a caring per... You cannot begin to imagine. How did you discover the body? I was set to perform in a fecundity ride with Fabio and came to inquire further. There was a staged ritual where he was to play the principal... And the rehearsal was... Un ha! Huh. Who knows? I found him alone on the altar, his blood dripping to the floor. And then? Then I called Mr. Manchios. He was panicking, so I told him about you. We left the room and locked the door. Then we were... Filling time. Waiting for you was stressful. We indulged in some simple comforts. Everyone knew Fabio, or wanted to. His beauty... He was magnetic. Fat wallets... What about the fertility ritual? There was something about Fab Fabio was supposed to portray the beauty of life's origin. Flowers. Or so this ritual is not the fertility rite. What was it meant to look? It begins with a woman lying naked in a flower bed on the altar. She represents Gaia, the earth. As, I As our calls reach a climax, Fabio enters and copulates with her. After he finishes, I stab her with a dagger. That part's just pretend, of course. But the intercourse is not? I did not expect you to be such a prude. Are you a virgin? 
It is nothing to be ashamed of, but it would explain the color of your cheeks. The fertility rite marks the start of our festivities. The principle of life is beautiful, intimate, is <sighs> Yet it appears that someone did stop it. Oh, yes, Matista. She's one of Fabio's compatriots and a performer, too. I haven't... When you discovered the body, was the door... No, it was locked. Oh, that reminds me. It's a minor detail, but the first time I came to speak to Fabio, I left without entering, having been unable to open the door. You didn't have the key? No, I had it. Don't look at me like that. I was mostly sober. I suspect there was a key in the other side of the door, blocking the lock. That detail may very well be major, Werner. Well done. So you returned later only to find the lock was not blocked? Correct. After an hour had passed, I tried again and was able to unlock the door. That's when I discovered poor Han... The police were... Some of them may be hiding behind their masks. They conceal many things. Besides, after a few cocktails, they're incompetent. How do you know I even want the case? I promised you relaxation. If there's one... Jaha, sit onkin vähän taas täällä <köhö> näitä vihjeitä. Toimme laitetaan pinnaukselle. Person leaned against the door frame. They left a smudged trail of blood. A bloody handprint on an armchair. The wounded person was here for some time. There appear to be no further traces leading to the altar. Nyt on taas joku jäänyt huomaamatta. Similar to the guests' robes, apart from the bloodstains. So, Sherry. Do you have any ideas about the case? Perhaps, but I think I will introduce what happened here. Tästä lyötiin päähän. 
No, katsotaan mitä tästä tulee. You're not even trying, Sherry. Hän on oikein täällä. Mut nää kaksi. Nää voi olla ihan... You're not even trying, Sherry. Concentrate. Nää nyt voi olla kummin päin vaan. You're not even trying, Sherry. Concentrate. You're not even trying, Sherry. Ah, kiva Concentrate. sitten, kun näistä kahdesta ei kyllä niinku todellakaan tiedä. Tämä on ihan päivä selvä. Tämä on tuohon puukotettu. Ja toi on laittanut ton lukkoon. Se nyt on ihan selkeä homma. Täällä on nää käden. Tolle niin se on pakko olla näin. Tää on pakko ollut lyödä tässä. Mä en ymmärrä näitten eroa. Täytyy olla tää tuntematon kaveri. Samaten tän täytyy olla tää tuntematon kaveri. Okei, okay, näskö tää uudestaan. Toi on tuntematon, toi on tuntematon. The bottle was used as a weapon during a scuffle in the smoking lounge. Then, to ensure no one would interrupt, the murderer locked the door. The unconscious body of the victim was moved to the altar room. Once the body was on the altar, the murderer thrust the dagger into the victim's heart. Symbols were drawn with the blood. The wardrobe was used to hide the bloodied robe from anyone's eyes. The killer washed himself and took a clean robe from the hanger before leaving. Are you all right? You're on the floor, not moving. I think I know what happened here. Ehdottomasti toi oli vaan, vaan tota noin hämäystä toi ää, rituaali tossa. Mut joo, nyt tää menee niin pitkäksi tää video, että me, me päätellään tää tältä erää tähän ja jatketaan ensi kerralla. Se on nyt morjesta.